for the Colorado River to erode the Grand Canyon. Is this how the Grand Canyon was actually formed? Can you imagine a lake in this basin up at 6,100 feet elevation? We call it Hopi Lake. Overtopping of a, a natural earth dam can create spillway erosion. erosion. And there's no such thing as slow failure of a natural dam in spillover. Um, I like to think of it as post-flood. It could be hundred years. Hundreds of years after after floods, possibly. So the idea isn't that the flood actually caused the Grand Canyon, but as the flood waters receded, there was a massive inland lake that overtopped and washed out the Grand Canyon, which is exactly what it looks like happened. Watch this animation. There may be three or four three different or four. lakes associated with the Grand Canyon itself, the lakes failed from the top down. The spillover of this Hopi Lake over the Kaibab Upwarp into the next basin below it created another lake below it, and they spilled, destroyed their dams by spillway erosion, and they drained to the west. You created the Grand Canyon by top-down failing of dams. Uh -huh. It didn't take millions of years for the Colorado River to erode the Grand Canyon. And, and you know, really, Steve, I can look around and at least imagine and vision this wasn't carved out by a river. This is the kind of thing that you see when massive water just floods and it just evacuates all of that yeah. material. Check this out. We've all seen the white water rafting in the Grand Canyon, yeah? Wee, fun, fun, fun. But why are there these huge rapids in the Colorado River? What causes the white water rapids in the Colorado River? Grand Canyon rapids are generally formed when debris washes down a side canyon into the Colorado River. The debris backs up the river and at times makes the main channel narrower. <laughs> Rocks are falling down the Grand Canyon into the Colorado River. Yeah, the river is actually filling in, not eroding away the Grand Canyon. Okay, now check this out. Did you know that Mars has a Grand Canyon? Did Mars Canyon form when plug was pulled? How did these gigantic canyons really form? The two possibilities for the water's escape were bursting out over the surface or funneling out below it like a plug pulled from a bathtub drain. So to confirm this, they enlisted the help of geologists at the University of Texas at Austin who built a desktop sized scale then drained it to see what would happen. The results of that were absolutely astounding to us, Adam said. They matched the formations found in the Hebes Chasm to a T. The most likely explanation for the Grand Canyon on Mars was a tremendous amount of water rapidly released, washing out the Valles Marineris. Grand Canyon, Valles Marineris. But they want you to believe that the Earth's Grand Canyon was formed by that tiny river when the river is actually filling in with debris. Why aren't we taught that the Grand Canyon may have been formed through a massive washout, like they believe happened on Mars? Because of this guy, Charles Lyell, who was of course a friend of Charles Darwin, and was a Scottish Scottish geologist largely responsible for the view that all features of the Earth's surface are produced by physical, chemical, and biological processes through long periods of geological time. Darwin needed millions and millions of years to go from tadpole to human. Lyell said, we need millions and millions of years to form something like the Grand Canyon. Lyell also saw himself as the spiritual savior of geology, freeing the science from the old dispensation of Moses. What did Moses write again? Oh yeah, the book of Genesis that tells the story of a global flood. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you believe that the Grand Canyon was not formed by a flood because Charles Lyell, who was friends with Charles Darwin, wanted to free science from Moses. Yeah, free geology from massive flooding, which has been proven to have happened all over the earth. The Missoula floods, the Altai Mountains, there's evidence of massive flooding all over the earth, including potentially the Grand Canyon. Ah!